Um, getting to Gabriel was a, a real adventure. Um, I think I started off uh, 48 years ago coming here for my honeymoon. And this was my, this was the perfect place for a honeymoon because it was so beautiful. And I saw there was a, uh, an apple tree that had hundreds of um, hummingbirds around it. it. Just, it was so gorgeous. So I determined at that point, someday I'm gonna live on Cape Reef. I'm inspired by a lot of things. Um, I'm inspired by going to galleries and seeing new techniques um, and you know, falling in love with some amazing paintings. And, uh, um, and also just what's around me. I do that. I quite often paint floral paintings, and uh, they're um, they're right here in our yard. It's uh, my wife is a wonderful gardener, just amazing. And uh, so we have over 50 roses, and uh, and I can't name all the different kinds of plants, but many many different plants. So that's very inspiring. That painting is of Mystic Beach, and Mystic Beach, um, I think if anybody's been there, would know that it's a very magical place. And I've painted it four times now, and all four paintings are completely different from each other. Because I'll go there and the lighting will be such, and, and another time there'll be more water. Um, so yeah, that, that painting is, uh, Fairly recent, finished it uh, maybe two months ago. And uh, I just uh, had been there and taken a bunch of photos and just uh, felt quite inspired by the place. This is my most recent uh, Raven painting. Um, I did it uh, at the end of last year in January. And uh, can I say I love painting ravens? I have literally painted probably in probably over a hundred paintings with ravens in them. And this one was kind of fun because I wanted to capture the, the motion of the of the raven and he's coming in for a landing. It's just a lot of fun doing something like that. Mostly I would, I've done uh, ravens that are um, either just sitting or standing on a branch. So this was a little more of a challenge, but uh, it turned out I think okay.